I've talked to Vatras. Ah, good. Where is he? He's preparing a ritual at the Circle of the Sun in order to heal the Eye of Innus. If that is true, then maybe there is hope after all. Vatras wants Zardas and you to help him with that. What? Zardas will be there too? You cannot be serious. Hey, this wasn't my decision. Vatras insists. It is always that Zardas. I am tired of it. Things could hardly get any worse. So how do I know that Zardas is not in league with the enemy? I cannot trust Zardas, no matter how much we may need him. I am sorry, but I cannot help Vatras under these circumstances. It can't be done without you. Vatras wouldn't be able to perform the ritual otherwise. You'll have to trust Zardas. There is nothing that I have to do, you hear? I do not have the slightest proof that Zardas is not working against us. I cannot do this. What if I could bring you some proof? That is impossible, I fear. It would really have to impress me. As far as Zardas is concerned, I have my doubts whether he can still impress me at all. What about a little blessing? I could surely use it. May Eno stand between you and harm on all the unholy paths you will have to walk. Hey, watch it. Hey. Vatra sent me to you. That's good. What did he say? He said something about a reversal ritual at the Circle of the Sun? <laughs> That old devil. I think I know what he's up to. You have come to summon me to him. Looks like it. When will you set out? I must not keep Vatras waiting. I shall be on my way immediately. You must fulfill your tasks and then join me again. Wait a minute. Pyrocar refuses to show up for the ritual. First, he wants proof that he can trust you. Ah, really? Pyrocar. How interesting. That old geezer is getting to be a nuisance. But I think I've got something for you that'll be useful. Back when I left the Order of the Fire Magicians, I took a few things with me from the monastery. I didn't want a troop of paladins or fire magicians to turn my tower upside down at some point and find all those things. So I hid them in safe places where the magicians would certainly never look for them. And where? Some of them lie locked in a chest on Sekob's farm. You trust that, Sekob? No but he can be bought and ask no awkward questions. Also, the chest is locked. Here's the key. There's a very old book among those things. When Pyrocar sees that book, he'll know it came from me. It is of no further use to me, so I guess it can at least fulfill this purpose. Is the reversal ritual going to work? I cannot be sure. That depends on what exactly Vatras is going to do. it.
That's no secret. If he doesn't see that, he never would have thought of that himself. The two of us should have a chat. Listen, you won. Now leave me alone. If you get involved in a duel with the mercenaries, that's one thing. But if you beat up on a farmer, they run straight to Onar, and he expects me to do something. You'll have to pay a penalty. Onar pockets the money himself as a rule, but it's the only way to settle the matter. How much? 250 gold pieces. I don't have enough gold. Then go get it as soon as possible. But just don't think you can steal it here on the farm. If you get caught, things will be even worse for you. Are you here to bring the money for Onar? I want to pay the penalty. Good. I'll see to it that Onar gets the money. You can consider the matter forgotten. I've come from the Valley of Mines. The castle there was attacked by dragons. So it's true. Lars said that rumors about dragons are circulating through the city. I didn't believe it. What about the paladins? They've been thoroughly decimated. Good. Maybe that will make Lord Hagen move to the Valley of Mines with his men. The fewer paladins stay here, the better. Onar now has a few sheep less thanks to Bulko. Oh, leave me alone with that shit. I've had enough trouble as it is. Bulko got what was coming to him. I've taught him a lesson. The swine deserved it. Hey, you! Is the amulet ready? Yes. Here. I had to make a new setting for the stone. I worked on it all night, and now it's as good as new. Hey! 
Everything all right with you? Well, it's so-so. My back hurts from all this hard labor. What are you doing here? I don't get visitors here all that often. Usually, it's either some cutthroats from the mountains or those horrible malicious soldiers from the city. They've been raiding our farm rather frequently lately, but you don't look like you're one of them, or are you? So what do you do when you're not busy playing ruler of the farm? Stand guard. The filthy militiamen from the city are coming onto our land more and more often and stealing everything they can get their hands on. Only last week the bastards were here, and they took some of our sheep. If I could get my hands on one of them, I'd make short work of them. But of course. Why don't the mercenaries help you against the militia? Before they even turn up, I've already driven them off. Have you seen any bandits passing through here? I certainly have. They passed along the edge of the field near Sekob's farm and entered the forest to the north. If my eyes didn't deceive me, they were also dragging a young woman along to the forest. I really hope they left her alone. Oh, I'm just glad they stayed away from our farm. Everything else all right? These are bad times. I can't find my sheep. I guess I'll have to fess up to Sekob. Hey, you! Did something happen? You've got to help me. The black robes have invaded my house. The Royal Guard people are supposed to take care of everyone's well-being, right? Those fellas said they were looking for something, but surely not in my house. Please help me make them go away again.
Your house is empty. The Black Hoods have left. I knew that the guard could be counted on. Not so fast, my friend. I don't understand. What else do you want? All that I can do is give you a bit of gold and ask you to spare me. Give it here then, I'm in a hurry. Here! brought this book from Zardas. It's a token of his trust. Show me. But this is incredible. Do you have even the slightest notion what it is that you just gave me? Um, no. This is an ancient, long-lost tome from days gone by. We all thought that it was lost for good, and now I learn that Zardas knew all along what had become of it. So will you be there for the ritual? Yes. I shall depart for the Circle of the Sun, but certainly not because I am convinced of Zardas' good intentions. In fact, I am going to make this jackal explain where he has kept the book hidden for so many years. He has definitely gone too far this time. I shall see you at the Circle of the Sun. change. You better watch out who you see.
is. Secret. Someone's got to do the work. Who says things like that? Take care of everything for everybody. 
Honestly, I witnessed it myself. Everybody knows by now. If I hadn't seen it in my own eyes... Hey, you! Can you also train me in sword fighting? Lord Andre has ordered that we train everyone who is in a position to defend the city. But that's only true for combat training. All other kinds of training are reserved for the militia. Can you at least halfway handle a weapon? I think so. All right, you can start when you're ready. Let's begin with the training. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following decree is hereby enacted. The Smith Bennett has been declared free of guilt because his innocence was proven by a clever advisor of Lord Hagen. Show me your wares. He simply talks too much. You don't say. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. And it's gonna get even worse. Who says things like that? Nice lighthouse you've got here. Thank you. Just walk on all the way up the stairs and take in the beautiful view, me lad. Make yourself at home. <laughs> 